San Antonio's Metropolitan Health District relaunching a program aiming to prevent infant deaths. Fetal Infant Mortality Review looks to better understand and address risk factors that contribute to the deaths of our youngest population. Pilar Arias introduces us to one mother who is sharing her story, hoping to help others. Named him Sebastian. He was a pound seven ounces. Sebastian was Roxanne Torres' fifth pregnancy, but not her first loss. Sometimes we only know our body. When she felt something was off, she told her doctor. It's advice she gives other expecting moms as well. Keep asking questions. If they feel like their body's telling them that something doesn't feel right, go further and ask more questions. Go to another doctor. Get a second opinion. Uh, Baby Sebastian was born at just 24 weeks and died two days later. Torres tells her story to help cope with the loss. It is horrible. Um, just knowing you're not bringing a baby home, it's the worst feeling ever. More than 80,000 babies were born in Bear County in 2014. Of those, nearly 7,300 had low birth weights. About 10,000 were born premature and close to 500 died. Those are numbers programs like the Fetal Infant Mortality Review aim to curb and learn from. We'll really be able to um, analyze cases, identify our risk factors, and then in the community form strategies to address the things that are really driving our infant mortality and other poor birth outcome rates. It's been five years since the program has been active in our area, but now thanks to new federal funding, a community action team will connect mothers to necessary resources so infants can have a fighting chance. Pilar Arias, KSAT 12 News.